Well, great job by Pat Crawl and Riley Gilliam today. Uh, you know, uh, didn't have to use uh, very many guys out of the bullpen because our starting pitching was so good. Uh, you know, I think we only gave up two runs on the weekend. Uh, you know, struggled to score some runs in some tough conditions. You got to give Boston College credit. I thought their starting pitcher today uh, did a really good job, uh, but we found a way to get it done. Uh, and it came from Reed Rollman, big sack fly late in the ball game, and then Seth Beer stepped up and gave us some insurance there at the end with the solo home run. Uh, played really good defensively uh, over the course of this weekend and today. And again, it was all about Pat Crawl and Riley Gilliam. They were outstanding for us today, and what a great trip uh, for Clemson Tigers baseball on spring break this year. We had a great time and ready to get back home. Here with Pat Crawl. Pat, talk about your performance today on the mound. Uh, you know, it was a little cold out. Um, you know, it's been a tough, tough couple of days for us, you know, weather-wise. But um, just going out there and not letting that affect us, I think we did a really good job of just playing the game and not letting that be an excuse. Um, it felt pretty good. Uh, I've been pitching this my whole life until I went down to South Carolina, so I felt really good today. What pitches were working for you today? For me, just getting ahead with a fastball. Um, establishing a fastball early so that I can go to different stuff later in the at-bats is something that was key for me, so I probably the fastball. All right, here with Riley Gilliam, you got the second save of the year. Talk about that uh, bases loaded, one out situation in the eighth inning. How you got out of that? Uh, just kept my composure. I stayed poised on the mound. I stuck to a pitch by pitch mentality. You know, making each pitch uh, as with or making each pitch with conviction, throwing it with conviction, and I just stuck to that, and that's what got me through it.